everything. Oh, uh, hey everyone. Uh, you may be asking yourself, or you might be asking me, where's part 23 of the 100% playthrough of Let's Play Clarence's Big Chance? Well, uh, long story short, part 23 was exceedingly boring. It was just me running around the office trying to find that last bit of chat-up advice and accomplishing entirely nothing and being incredibly boring. So I'm just going to skip straight to part 24 because I think it's a lot more entertaining and it actually progresses the game, unlike part 23, which did absolutely nothing. So, uh, sorry that there's no part 23, but that's just how it goes. But uh, at least the story will continue in part 24. So uh, I hope you enjoy part 24 and resume. Hey, welcome to part 24. Let's play Clarence's a big chance. Well, I feel dumb. Why? Because I found that last uh, advice tip. And uh, instead of showing a screenshot, I'm just going to show you where he was. It's this guy right here. Yeah, just some random guy. Just sitting in the computer. Uh, rather eloquent. For a drone, but uh, you know, that was the last bit, and uh, I feel especially bad about this because uh, I will admit to you that I had to. Oh, this is difficult to say. I had to resort to looking at a walkthrough to finding this. Thankfully, it was the walkthrough on the official uh, game creator's website, so I don't feel as bad about it. As if, say, I looked up some other random guy on YouTube's video to try and find this last tip. Also, I feel that my voice representation of the boss was not adequate, so I'm going to give you this whole. I'm going to do this whole thing again. Hello there, employee. How are you this wonderful day? Okay, let's have a see at how good you are have been doing at this work today. Like man, okay? You have done 10 out of 10 tasks today, soldier, okay? Wow, that's super, dude. I think, I think I'm gonna give to you that promotion you always want us. No, here you go. Also, you get 1,000. Don't spend it on it at once, big boy. Oh, yeah. No, you can have this suit cause you're an executive now don't spend it all in one place haha <laughs> day's over now you go home okay bye <laughs> wow that was difficult Whew. And so Clarence, done with his work, is wrought up with anxiety. Okay, I already did that last time. No many achievements. And didn't one of your many mothers ever? <laughs> I forgot about that. One of your many mothers tell you that it's rude to go barging into every door that you see. You can't get through this one anyway. It's locked tight. So we are now in chapter four. This is the last last gasp before the date. What do I need to get? I don't know that, because I got all that crap. 200 coins, 4 tips, and a little something extra. But I'm going to go in here, and... Oh, these guys are bastards. I fucking hate these guys. Why do I fucking hate these guys? Because those guys can steal your coins. Yeah. You gotta be fast in this place. Otherwise, these bastards steal your coins. That's not cool, man. To the guy who made this game, that's not cool. 
Ugh. This also looks bad. But again, ah! Okay, disappearing platforms. Fantastic. Whew. Okay, there's more stuff over there. So I'm going to go over there first. Or not. Coppers! I'm scared. Running, running, running. Okay, I can't get to either of those guys, so okay. Oh! Whew. Whoa, whoa! Oh. <laughs> oh, crap, I can't get back up there! Except by. Come on, get in there! <laughs> well, that was failure. Where am I? Oh, I'm here, okay. I can do this horrible thing all again. Whoops! Running, running, running. I'm gonna go to the left this time. Why, I'm not completely sure. But, ooh, okay. This is one of the three shops where you can buy stuff. I have for sale but three items. They will help you out on a date. This is for sure. Are you going on a date, my old friend? It looks like it. You may purchase a single item for 250 pounds. Yes, it's British. But when I say a single item, I mean a single item. You can take but one, not two, not all three, but only one. You must choose carefully. This particular shop sells delicious chocolates. Yum yum, a, first, a surefire way to win your way into a girl's heart. As long as you resist the temptation to scoff them all down, you greedy gob, before you meet them, fatso. On the left, you'll find a scrumptious spe specimen species of lovely milky white chocolate. It is very milky, but remember, it is not milk chocolate. To the right, to its right, however, you will see real, genuine, bona fide milk chocolate. Everyone's favorite, except some people who ate it, but they're monsters. Third in the line, but not third in quality, is the rich dark chocolate. Very rich but the same price as the others. Bizarrely, some wackos like this one most. Take your pick, young sir, but choose well, lest you disappoint your lady friend with a well-intentioned but poorly planned give insult to her preferences. Which one does she want? It's one of those tips. Dark chocolate. She loves dark chocolate. Okay. I'm taking the dark chocolate. Yes. Splendid choice. That'll be $250 from you, Sunny Jim. Uh, now get out of my shop and don't come back ever again. <laughs> and, of course... What did I say about never coming back? You have one of my items already. You need no more than that. Live with that choice you made and be gone. Okay. Luckily, I'm happy with the choice I made because it's the right one. Blow! And yes, you do need to buy these items in order to get a good ending. Oh, hey. I'm back here again. Oops. Woo! Bam! Alright. Uh, I'm going to save and uh, I'm going to stop for now because... Uh, I'm getting a little tired of this game right now. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I'm fine, actually. All right, thanks for joining me for part 24, probably, I guess, of Let's Play Clarence's Big Chance. I love the music in this level. I'm going to try and see if I can get one of my friends to do a cover of this. Yeah. All right. See you later.